Good day everyone. Well, there is a common problem in Windows 10 and Windows 11 computer. Using the Edge browser, sometimes you get your browser is managed by your organization. So that's a kind of an infection and today we are going to remove it. So just do a right click in the start icon and then click on run. And here type regedit. So we'll be doing three, four steps and definitely it will be fixed. So once you have typed it regedit, then hit OK. Click on Yes. And here, just go to File and Export. And export to your desktop. Give it a name or anything. So that, let's say if something goes bad, you can restore the registries back to the same point. So once this is done, just go to HKey Local Machine here. And then we need to go to Software. So we need to double click on this software and at the top you will find the location so it's hk local machine then software and here we are looking for policy so i'll just do a double click here and then we need to go to this microsoft and here you will find edge browser so if you have any value here so what you can do is you can simply do a right click and then just click on delete and say yes so in this manner if you have any kind of policy set by any malware or infection that will be removed and see if your browser is working fine or not if it's not i'll tell you one more effective step which you can follow so i'll open the edge browser and at the top just type h then colon forward slash forward slash management so once you have typed it hit enter so if you have any kind of policies it will show right here I can see Microsoft Edge is not managed by company organization so here I don't have anything but in case if you have it here you will have the option to delete and remove it so you can do that and just close it and reopen it and most probably it will be fixed and let's say if you are unable to remove it then I'll tell you some commands in the description which you need to run as an administrator you just need to copy these commands the, there are three commands so we need to paste it one by one here in the search icon just type cmd and you will find command prompt so just run as administrator and then click on yes copy the first command like this and paste it right here and hit enter so in this manner if you have any policy editor that will be refreshed and it will be back to normal once this is done, do the second command and hit enter and that will be done. And the third command is gp update space forward slash force. So you can see computer policy update has completed success. So you can do that and then you just need to restart the computer and most probably your edge browser problem will be fixed. Once this is done, there is one more step which you can follow. So just open the edge browser and just click on this three dots and then go to settings and here at the left hand side you will find reset settings and from here if just click on this reset and this is not going to remove your favorites history and save passwords so it will not be removed so you can simply reset it and most probably the issue will be fixed if it's a adware or something then it might not fix it so for that here you just need to type Google and here you can type malware bytes. Now once you have typed malware bytes, hit enter and please make sure that you visit only www.malwarebytes.com. I'll open the website and here you can download the malware bytes and just do a complete scan and once the scan is completed, restart the computer, remove all the infections from quarantine and then uninstall the application so you can do that that is up to you if you want to keep the malware bytes you can keep it so all these steps are very effective if you have any infection even if you have it in the chrome you can do the same procedure and it will be fixed so i hope you have enjoyed this very short video please hit the like and subscribe and if you have any computer performance issues please watch the video which you will get it at the end and this will surely help. Have a wonderful day.